Hey everyone, how's it going and welcome to Todd's Tech Tips. Today, I'm going to be taking you through Minecraft version 1.6. There's a new launcher, a few new features, but most natively horses and name tags. Both of these are pretty cool, and I'll be taking you through them now. So first off, a name tag. So a name tag allows you to name a mob, like a zombie or a pig or a dog or a wolf, whatever you want to call it, a cat, anything, and it's uh, when you're on multiplayer it shows up on other people's screens as well. So when you highlight, mouse over a certain mob, it shows the name of it. Uh, you can rename it. <laughs> Please subscribe there. Um, so to name a mob, all you have to do is go into creative. You can do this in uh, survival too. I'll have a tutorial down at this in the description. And just go to name tag, get a blank name tag, also another new feature, it shows you what, um, I think it's a new feature anyway, shows you what category it's in. Um, and if you go over to the anvil here, we also need an anvil. Right click it, drag a blank name tag up, or another name tag, you can rename name tags. And we'll backspace the name tag out, and we'll say hello all. Over here will be the completed name tag. We can drag that down, and now you've got a name tag that says that says "Hello All." These aren't stackable, so I can't stack them, sadly. But yeah, that's the price you have to pay. Um, I don't know why anything. I don't know why everything is stackable. Anyway, then you just right-click on a mob, and you're done. That's how you name things. You can name horses and things like that. So if we do that, please subscribe. There you go. And another, interest, another interesting thing is if we go to rename the name tag, and if we type it in dinner bowl, hoping that's it. Hold on a second. Sorry about that there, just a little bit of a typo. It's dinner bone. So dinner bone, an N, not an L. Stupid Todd. And if we go over here again, watch this. It goes upside down. It's pretty cool. Um, now you can see the mobs upside down. So we can go over here and we can rename him Dinnerbone. And he's upside down. You can rename him back to Hello All and he comes back up. Um, but Dinnerbone and Grum are the two things. Grum, I think it's just with Grum with two M's. That's a uh, developer's name of Minecraft. And that's a little, I guess, Easter egg that's now not an Easter egg. Or, yeah, it's not listed in the features that you can name things and they'll go upside down. So, that's the main things of Minecraft 1.6. The horses, again, um, all you have to do is keep on right clicking it with nothing in your hand. So, we'll get everything out. And you have to just try and break it in, I guess. Get rid of that. And after that, it doesn't buck you off anymore. You need to get, whoops, pump my microphone. You need to get a saddle. So, saddle. And we shall go on the horsey again. And you just need to right click whilst on the horse. Why won't it let me? You sometimes need to give it golden carrots too. Anyway, the horses are still, I'm getting used to them still, but they're pretty cool once you get the hang of them. Um, playing with them all night, how can I not remember that? Anyway, thank you again for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe to Todd's Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos. Once again, dinner bone. <laughs> that never gets old. Thanks again for watching, guys, and don't forget to subscribe.